everything is one well how how do you know everything is one what that means like everything is one well it just is um it sounds very unfamiliar to some people probably but maybe the best description of this will be something like the state of flow people who ex experienced it to be in that kind of state of flow they were connected with with something they were connected with one they they successfully connect themselves through something with one and in that way they experience this kind of uh, euphoria feeling which is always so amazing but anyways like how can you know this how can you know that this something like this exists well the the settings the setting is partly because you cannot fully understand until you experience it until you have experienced that that kind of thing um it's basically knowing it's just knowing you when you're in it you just know that it is and it's just understanding it cannot be explained as you're trying to explain like why the try to describe like the, to the fish uh, water water to the fish try to explain water to fish like you know like that's her god so to say you know without water she cannot live like we, we, we cannot live without oxy oxygen and so on food etc etc so basically it cannot be described it must be experienced that's it basically there was experience like there was a like a, a experiment done um, on this subject like really let's put it on a test like scientists uh, one person was on one part of the planet of the globe another one was another on a different part of the globe like distance was like I don't know like let's say 10 or 12,000 of kilometers and one person they were having like everything like on the head this kind of uh, things for testing and so on and basically one person was just imagining like closed closed eyes imagining second person which is on another part of the planet like really exp fully uh, feeling how it is uh, to hug that another person like that that another person as it is here and now in the present moment and just imagine how they are hugging each other and after a few seconds on another part of the planet this person was having the same activations uh, on the on the brain same activities on the brain as the first person at the first place and that was something very magnificent you know <laughs> like think about it like that means that everything that it is on this planet and everything in this uh, we call it universe is just one thing there is no separation we think that there is separation but that's also just thinking it's not real but we make it real Something else I wanted to share is basically that why we don't experience often this kind of feelings and being connected because we, my opinion, I think we got so used to it to we are so addicted to be distracted and we so got used to it, that kind of believe that it has to be hard everything and many other distractions that are keeping you it you're not very far away you're just like one pattern you know like one way of thinking far away which is like nothing you know just in your head but it changes everything the whole day the whole week the whole month the whole life the whole year everything and everything else is teaching you kind of uh, opposite that is not like that that cannot be so amazing and so f 
free and so great and so awesome and that's just addiction like and everything you see uh, outside most of them 99 percent they accepted that that kind of idea and they just follow it without even thinking about it because it's scary when you find out the truth about yourself it's very hard to face yourself sometimes like to see yourself and when i said this to see yourself this is also interesting because after some time after some time you you work on yourself and eventually you will start to realize something that i call uh, self imaging self uh, image seeing like yourself in other people like recognizing the parts of yourself in other people uh, the patterns of behavior the traits personal traits and so on and you see it clearly it's scary sometimes but then you realize like hmm like uh, everything is kind of the, the same everything is part of me as well so everything that I am is also existing in my current life. It has to be like that. Everything that you have accepted as true, it has to exist. There is a, like, a scientific proof of that. The more something you're repeating, the more you're doing, it becomes the habit, it becomes automatic. And it's in a subconscious mind at that point. And basically the neurons between, like in a network, like in your brain, are very like uh, getting uh, stronger and stronger and basically this kind of uh, behavior or this kind of um, image or this kind of car or this kind of clothes or whatever it is is showing up more often in your reality and that's how it works it's just like we have a, like a like just empty like blank sheet of paper and whatever that is here accepted that's going to be on outside in the paper as well. So that's also kind of connected with this topic, this idea of everything is one, which is, but it's hard to accept. And it takes courage to live that kind of way. And to be really like okay with that. And just to accept it and live it that kind of way. When you're defining your uh, life purpose or what you love to do, Eventually, we got to the point where you, you cannot explain it. And that happened to me and that happened to many people. Um, because it's just not possible to describe. You just know that it is. As you are in the flow. So you see how these two things are connected. Like being in the flow. And knowing what you want. What you love to do. What's your purpose. Like what, you, what makes you excited. It's kind of almost the same thing. Because as you define it, it's just the feeling, what you love to do, what we like to have more of. What is that uh, ultimate feeling, you know, that you want to experience over and over again, what you love. That, that's, that, these two things are kind of the same. Because this, when you define it, it's just a feeling. It cannot be described. You just know. It's knowing. The same as state flow, the same as being connected, the same as whatever puts you 100% in this in this current moment right now and you forget but you forget about everything else past and the future that's 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 kind of that's maybe the best <clears throat> description for that if i if i find this video or a movie or what whatever whatever that was i don't remember now because it was a long time ago as i was uh, watching it but it's it's very interesting. It's very interesting. It's very exciting to to see something like that happening, like testing this kind of test, like one person on one part of the planet, another person on another part of the planet, and they're just kind of communicating with each with each other without anything, without wires, without anything, just using the the yourself, like the human being. See you in the next video.